Well, the next time you head to Denver International Airport, your ride to the terminal should be faster and smoother. Yes, yeah, because today the airport launching their brand new train cars. Matt Morrow here now to explain Matt. Well, Jeremy, Erica, these new train cars really couldn't come at a better time. Summer is the busiest season for the airport and nearly 880,000 people are set to go through TSA checkpoints this week alone. Then they'll be off on these new train cars. Take a look. This is one of the new cars that's now up and running in the next year. The airport will get a total of 26 and keep 15 older ones. As more new cars arrive, DIA will start replacing the oldest ones. Some of them date back to when the airport opened in 1995. So in all, the airport will have 51 train cars. The new ones are faster, smoother, and more energy efficient. Soon, they'll have regenerative braking to be able to put power back into the system. They'll also be able to move more people, up to 850 more per hour. Plus, they'll be more comfortable. There are several new amenities on this uh, train car. First and foremost is the heating and air conditioning on these cars. Uh, with the warm summers that we have here in Denver in the cold winters, it's important for us to make sure that we provide a good customer experience on these cars. Right now, the plan is for the trains to run in groups of four, but that will likely change in the next few years. DIA is already making plans and make to make room for more entry and exit doors to connect five and even six of the train cars together. That's really for 2027 when the airport expects to handle 100 million passengers every year. Also new today, we're getting an update on the much needed alternative to the trains for when they don't operate for one reason or another. The airport is still collecting ideas from private companies and today talked a lot about a walking or a pedestrian bridge that could connect all of the terminals. It expects to have a final decision on that plan sometime in the next six months. Jeremy. Yeah, much needed, Matt.